Because there's too much nose here, I gotta use that a little bit. I just got bored and said, what the hell, I'll make this. I didn't really get bored, but I woke up and I was like, what the hell do I do now? The day's done. I wish he wasn't so smooth because I'm going to have to smooth all of this out a bit. It's hard to get the really big ripples out of there once it's hard. If you're just sanding it down with a Dremel, this would take a long time. So you want to kind of get it as close as you can, but tapping it like that will ease all your corners. That will make it a little softer looking. Now, sometimes I'll go through and I'll I'll fill that with black paint after the fact, but it doesn't really seem to seem to ever feel fill in as good as I like it. So I'm going to fill it with black clay, and I think his gels are a little bit a little bit more than what it needs here. make this a little longer because it's so ridiculously long I'll wash this with rubbing alcohol and get a lot of the fingerprints off because it's it's soft enough where I, I should be able to get away with doing that but just trying to uh, it's so soft that just trying to get rid of the fingerprints on it right now is 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 dragging the clay which makes it really difficult to work with I like it a lot harder than this but you could just learn the medium and do it the way you have to work with what you got that's what I always was told I need a quote. I still need a quote. Luke Thomas, what's up? Linda, what's up? Jonathan, what's going on? Jonathan. Everybody's saying hi to Jonathan. Hey, it's look at that. Okay, I'm trying to go back and read what's going on. Uh, you won the race? Good. All right. Paul Capello, what's going on, man? Just blasting out something quick for the week's thing so I can get back to my Mad Max sculpture I'm working on, the Gyro Captain. But I gotta do a Tim Burton, so I, I'm doing Jack Skellington. So I'm doing one of these potion bottles, Jack Skellington, real quickly. Real quick, like, see? So then that won't be on my mind all week that I have to get it done. And then I'm scrounging at the end trying to get it done. And plus I'm up, so why not? Are you ever going to stop back in town, dude, or what? Jonathan Meadows, what's up? We're going to throw some black clay on there and it should start pulling this all out. I think I might have gone a little low here. I think maybe I should have kept the mouth up a little high, but I'm going to roll with what I got. Smooth a little bit of this out a little more. Sometimes just the round end of stuff will work too. And not drag it as much, you can just roll it out. Get rid of all the peaks and valleys and stuff, try to fill them in. That way it doesn't look too, too bumpy. Too lumpy and blumpy. 
because it'll happen. Man, I did this in almost two songs. What the heck? All right. And I also gave away what I'm making for the on my art group. I gave that totally away. It's usually supposed to be a secret, but I'm not going to say it on there in case... Yeah, I don't know. Everybody's going to know what I made. Oh, well. Let's see. All right. I think I should have brought that up a little higher because when you set the bottle down, it seems a little low. But, like I said, we're going to roll with that. And I think we probably should have had a little, little wider in between the eyes, but that's okay, too. I'm going to roll with it. See what else? Drink. When I wrote that, I was thinking to myself, what do I say often that would get everybody to oh yeah, I say that a lot. Watch, now I'm gonna be all self-conscious and I won't say it. But I do need some uh, a quote from this guy, a Jack Skellington quote, so I can write it on the banner in the back. I'll show you what I'll do after I get these eyes on. Actually, I should cut it out now. Let's do that. Before I... Now I gotta do this with it. So I gotta find the middle, which is nose is there. So we're gonna go here. Okay, so the middle's right there. I think it's a little more over here, actually, but... Maybe even farther, but... And you can see what's in there, or if it's full or not full, and you can put whatever you want in there, whatever fits. It. People say, well, what do you put in there? I say, well, whatever fits. Kind of a silly question, if you ask me. So I'm going to leave this open window in it. Like I said, for so you can see whatever's in there. You don't want to open it if there, you know, bumblebees in there. What do you got in there, bumblebees? That'd be kind of cool. What do you got, man? All right, I'm just trying to see if it's if it's centered. See, because it's right there, and that's right there. So you kind of want it in the center, so. Not too bad. I got to take a little bit more from over here. Come on. This is so soft and sticky. I will never buy this again. I will never buy Sculpey 3 again. Sculpey 3 sucks. That's all I got to say. I almost took the dryer to the stuff just to get some of the stink out of it. But no sucks. Not happy with it. Craft Smart works better. Craft Smart's got a better consistency than Skull P3. This is like regular Skull P original, just the regular really cheap stuff. I don't like it at all. I only got it because they didn't have the Craft Smart cheap stuff, man. Anyway, let's go like that. What does he say? He says, like, I am the pumpkin king or something like that, right? Which one is it? Just because I cannot see it does not mean I can't believe it. Oh, that's perfect. Sold. I'll put that on there. Easy enough. All right, let's go to the black. I'm going to get this white out of the way so I didn't ruin it. That's really... I didn't use a whole lot. If you saw when I started, I had a block like that. I only used a small bit. This is a quick one you can make. I have a YouTube channel, for those of you who didn't hear. I just opened up a YouTube channel. Well, reopened a YouTube channel. I'm going to try to do live stream from that at some point, too. 
I'll have to do that by a schedule, but that's, if I get up to a thousand view, what is it? You get up to a thousand viewers or, or subscribers and you start getting paid or something like that. Give it a shot. A friend of mine, a friend of mine's brother does it and he's got, he gets paid like a hundred bucks a month or something because he makes, uh, he's a woodworker and he does stuff on there. I forget what it, I, I'd give him a shout out, but I can't remember the name. It's written down somewhere. So yeah, black, we need the black. Preferably not mixed with any white, but, no, you know, I got to work all this wood off of my fingers. One second. Fan Art Workbench. Thank you very much, Jonathan. Thank you. That is what it is. That's my YouTube channel, is Fan Art Workbench. Surprised it wasn't taken, to tell you the truth. Ow. I got cramps in my hands, man, and that's... It's not good. It hurts when I play my guitar. See, that's not nearly dark enough because I got all that white mixed in with it. From my hands, believe it or not. That's just from my hands. Look at that. What it did. I don't know if you can tell the difference, but wow. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do this. This is what you wanna use. Rubbing alcohol, 91% is what I found. It's the highest I could find. And rub your hands with some of that and do not have any open flame open flame bad try not to pass out when you do it if I pass out from the fumes from this stuff <laughs> call my wife let her know I'm passed out at my bench all right it does clean it off really fast though just a little tip all right it should be enough. And I'm gonna get a fresh piece of black too, off the old block. Don't need a lot. I like working with black usually because uh, sorry, I just just as I did that, I went into a zone. Sorry. Uh, I don't mind using black because my hands are usually always dirty. Yeah, I gotta move this open for it. You guys are seeing this reverse. It's really reversed from what you guys are seeing. That was a redundant thing to say, wasn't it? You just kind of, when you're doing this, and you're adding one color on top of the other and trying not to mix them, you got to kind of get the shape and then make it a little smaller than what you need. And then draw it out to what you really need once it's sitting on top of the center of the hole. So I'll go like this. And I'll put that in there lightly. Of course, I gotta have the most contrasting black with white. Once one touches the other, it's like all over. Like right there, I'm gonna have to scrape that off. There we go, that's a little better. Ah, everything's falling down. 